Hello YouTubers, this is MIT Oops and today I will teach you how to fix blue cell phone on the Wi-Fi in Windows 7. Here I am using my laptop and I just turn on the power. And here I am using SSD hard drive. It loads pretty quick, so let it just boot up and see what the problem is. Okay, that's very annoying. I know. That's okay. We'll fix this problem. Now it doesn't respond. We'll just wait until it gets discovered the network. Okay, after waiting for two minutes, it has just connected. No, no, you probably got the same problem and so this is how we fix this problem press uh, windows plus r key and this thing will pop up and you have to just write msconfig remember guys this is just for windows 7 i have no idea about windows 8 or 10 so make sure you will the same windows while fixing this problem. And after writing msconfig, you need to press enter. Ok, now we are in general blue service store. Ok, you have to go straight to the services. And press idle. services has been running on. All you got to just press disable all and press apply. Okay. Now we'll just reboot the computer. And we'll see if we are able to fix the problem. We'll get to know which software is, you know, taking lots of time. There is one or two software got the problem which is conflicting the network. We'll do the same. Okay, we'll go here and well, now we'll, what we'll do is we'll just start enabling one by one services. Like which software is giving us problems. You may need to do this for like 10 to 12 times, depending on the services you are running. Oh, 
go for the three one. Let's see how it goes. Restart. There he goes. See, that's definitely team viewers' problem. It's conflicting the my Wi-Fi device. That's why it's, it's not, you know, loading up for two or three minutes. It gets freezed. I mean, even your taskbar, you can't do anything. So the the main problem is. Do is I just go to this config press services I come on and I'll just go all again and simply press team viewer conflict team viewer okay let it finish because yeah, I need it. it will freeze it too. Um, let the spin thing get in, so we'll be able to restore it. just to disable this particular service and I press OK and I'll just go restore Still doesn't work well. Maybe maybe we should disable Intel Intel services as well. Okay. I'll just switch off some of them. But I don't really use it.
um even i don't want this acrobat okay press apply again okay Blazing fast, it boots up so quickly that I don't have to wait for any, anything. Or like HDD. Okay. Right. There we are. The problem is fixed. It boots up quickly and everything seems to be working. Ah, <sighs> so. I hope you liked my this video and if it helps you just subscribe me or share my video to someone else and thanks for watching.